everyone. Thank you for tuning in. I'm Mike, and we're sitting here. We're uh, discussing uh, pH. And so today, actually, what brings up this video is I was in Publix. I was in the market for buying spring water. And so when I was walking down the aisle, I saw uh, this Alkali 10 that has a pH of 10. And so when I, I saw it, I said, wow, I'm going to try it out. I want to see if it actually has a pH of 10. And so today we're going to test it out to see exactly if it has it. And what I have here to test it are some pH strips that I got from Just Fitter. Um, and just so that you know exactly what, what it says here, it says for your urine, if you're going to test your urine or your saliva, this is the range that you want it to be in. For your urine, you want a range of 6.7 to 7.0, which is ideal, okay? Because your body is getting rid of those toxins and getting rid of the acidness that's inside of you, okay? And so for saliva, a range of 7.0 to 7.5 is ideal, okay? That means that your body is basically at a balance when it comes to its alkalinity. Now, what does it say? It says pH below these levels indicate that you are acidic, and should be monitored closely by testing two times per day over a long period of time to get an average reading. So you guys can definitely uh, benefit from using these strips just to maintain and check your alkalinity uh, throughout the day. All right, so we have this spring water here that has a pH of 10, as you can see. All right, now this bottle here I have already opened, just to show you guys, I've already opened it, I tested the bottle already and I put some um, of my pH booster in here and I'll go over that with you guys in just a minute. And so <clears throat> I just wanted to boost it up just a little bit. And the reason I'm showing you this is just to let you know that because this bottle here, it has not been opened. So I want you to see as I twist it, it still has a safety uh, cap um, still intact there. So when I open it up, then you guys know it has not been tampered with. I didn't put anything in here. All right. <clears throat> And this is the, uh, the strip. Maybe you guys can see that. They're both yellow. All right. And so what we're going to do here is test it. And just so that you can understand where your level should be, in case you guys never seen this before, is that the more you are over here to the right in the yellow, which indicates that you are acidic, and the more you are over to the left to a 9.0, you are alkaline and anything that sits in the middle you guys are what you're balanced okay and that's where you want your body to be that's what you want your liquids that you're drinking to be mainly your water okay and you need to hydrate yourself you know several times throughout the day so you want to make sure you're drinking good uh water with uh with a high level of ph and that's to get rid of the toxins and the acidness because what uh disease live and in, in, in a body that, that is in a constant acidic state, okay? All right, so we have our bottle. This is the one that's not open. Let's take a look one more time. Okay, it's not open, as you can see. All right, so let's go ahead and open it. All right, we're opening it, as you can see. And so, I have my strip and we're going to test it and basically all you want to do is, is just stick it in here for a couple of seconds and then we're going to pull it out okay come on buddy there it is all right that's what it looks like at a uh right now now remember what i told you guys that what the more it is to the right the more acidic the more to the left it is the alkaline and as you can see, right now, this sits at about 6.75 to a 70. Oh, I'm going to try to put that there so you guys can see it and you can kind of weigh it out yourself. But as you can see, let's put the strip up there. And that's kind of, you can see where it is. All right, guys. All right. Now, <clears throat> so basically what we can 
be safe to say at this point is that when you're purchasing and buying water off the shelf that claim they have a pH, especially a 10, I'm pretty sure when they brought it out, packaged it up, you know, brought it out of the uh, warehouse at that point or brought it or, or went through the, the, the process, shall I say, um, it was pretty much a 10 at that time. Okay, but because it sits over a period of time, it's not going to maintain its alkalinity because what alkaline water is only going to maintain its alkalinity three to five days. So if it's sitting there for a month. Okay, so as we can see, this water is close to a, a balanced state, but it's moving towards uh, its acidic state because it has been sitting. All right. So now that we've gotten that out the way what i have here is what we call ph ion booster okay we bought this off of amazon really great company they have a lot of products you guys can go check it out and if you want to you can go down there and check out the link inside the comments i've actually put that in there just for you to go ahead and purchase that if you want to find out more information they have plenty of it there too but if you get it on Amazon, you're going to get it for a very good price. If you go to Whole Foods, it's going to cost a whole lot more. And what you get here in this uh, booster pack is you get the ion booster where they inject the water full of ions, negative ions. And so what happens is, is that this gives it the negative. Uh, I mean, it gives it that charge that it that your body needs. You're charging up your body because what your body operates off of electricity and those negative ions is what gives your body that electricity. OK, and then here's your pH booster. All right. That you're going to get in here. That's going to also help boost your water. So let's take a look and see exactly what the pH uh, booster is going to do. I'm going to put about 15 drops in here. Four, five, six. Okay, that was about 20. Hey, I like to go over overboard. All right. And now let's add some pH boost. I'm going to put at least about 25 drops in here. Okay. I'm going to put the top back on here. Kind of shake it up just a tad bit. All right, so as you can see, I'm going to show you this is what it was before. Okay, and so now we're going to take the top off. We're going to get our tester. I'm going to hold this a little bit closer to the So you guys can actually see it change. You see that? It's, it's, it's starting to change, guys. Is that alkaline? The one on the left is where you want to be. That is a alkaline state of water. So based upon these rules here, where does it sit? Okay. Okay. You see where it brought it up to? And if we add more, because it's a lot of water in here. So clearly we're going to have to add a, a little bit more if you want to go higher with that to make it the alkaline 10. But as you can see, that took it to a alkaline alkalinity state of about an eight between eight and an 8.5. That's pretty good. Now, if you want to go 10, then of course you can actually add more pH booster in there, but an 8.0 is pretty good to really start flushing out your body. But to make it very, very effective, then I would say at least about a 9.0. Okay. So you can add just a few more shots. Matter of fact, you can see it's on an 8.0. Let's just add a few more shots just, just for video sake. Let's do it. Why not? Get it going. 
Let's get this one out the way because this one was our first one. This was our second one. And now we're going to use our third one. All right, guys, you ready? And here it is. Let's watch it turn. There it is. There it is. It's already there. This is what you want. This is the kind of water that you want to be drinking here. When you stick these strips in here, you want it to turn this color. Okay? All right. So let's try to hold all three of these up. That's the last one, the second one, and the first one. And then we're gonna add one that hasn't been tested. And we can get all those in there. How's that sound, guys? You see the one on the very far right? You see how bluish that is? That blue has taken us to an alkaline, alkalinity of a 9.0. There it is. All right, guys, thank you for tuning in. I'm Mike, and uh, are you alkaline today? Ah! Uh -huh.